Well, hello, fellow Smashbook lovers. This is Joyce coming to you from the barn. And since today's page is on gratitude, actually our whole book is on gratitude, I thought I'd come out to the barn because, you know, I do love the barn and I love my critters. So if I can, I get a little shot of the critters at the end of this. But I wanted to, to give you a head start on your grateful page if you're if you're ready for it, because this weekend I'd like to see your um, your playground page, you know, your just your fun page, your vacation page, whatever it was that you wanted to do. So, but for when you're done with your vacation page, you can get a start on your grateful page too if you want. So I, what I did is I took all things I'm grateful for, and actually this is from another other sheets of paper. And I took them all and I glued them in here because um, I'm going to go through them all because some of them are what I'm grateful for, but they're going to also, it's going to bring up a lot of things that, um, you know, are on the other side of what you're grateful for because there's, you know, the dark and the light. Usually what you're grateful for makes you realize, well, yeah, you know, I am grateful for that, but I'm not grateful for this. So here's, here was my thought process. So I wanted to say, first of all, that I'm grateful for the gifts in the external world. World, I have so much. I have these awesome animals, you know, and life is just pretty fun. But I also realize that I have to be grateful for myself and what's inside of me because being grateful for gifts in the world is futile if you don't have joy for the gifts that are inside of you. They just go together. So it's important to work on your own joy and your own self-love for sure. So I'm extremely grateful for the stores that are open, health care and breathing and all of the people who are taking care of the sick people. I'm so grateful for them. I'm grateful for the people who love me. And I'm grateful for people who have big hearts, you know, and their hearts are open and they're just loving and, you know, full of life. And that's the way I want my heart to be. I do protect it and I want it to open. I want it to open up. And so uh, that's the other side of something that I could be working on. But growing up, my mother was always a big influence for our entire family with her faith, her hope, and her wishes for her children to have unconditional well, unconditional love. She gave us unconditional love, but she always wanted the best for us. And her that was her foundation, and she gave me my foundation. My roots, if I were a tree, would be inherited from her and from my grandma. And... Uh, yeah, and then the gratitude things would all be the leaves and everything else on the top, all the all the fruits of, you know, these nice strong roots. And I'm even grateful for the hurdles and hardships because they didn't shut down my spirit. I didn't call on these hardships, but I survived. And, you, you know, I learned. And I know that uh, whatever experiences I've, experienced have been necessary for me on this good old earth so I know that I'm so grateful for the courage to be honest and vulnerable and I know it could be better but I do believe sharing our stories is important towards wholeness and I'm so excited to work on this page with you so if you want to start your page with things you're grateful for and maybe they'll bring up the other side for you won't you I'm really not grateful for this, but wow, that is in my life experience. And if I'm grateful for my life, well, there it is. So right now, what I'm going to do is just uh, stop with that so you can work on your page. And I'm going to take you out and we're going to go say hi to the horses. I don't know how good that's going to work. But here we go, through the barn, through the barn.
going, going, going. I'm sure somebody's here listening to me. When they hear me talking, they'll be have their ears right against the window out here. Well, who's here? Nobody. Nobody but Belle. Okay, Belle. I came out to say hi to you, but you could come over here and give me a snuggle if you want. All right, sunshine. We'll try later.